Hey guys, welcome back to Vios Garage. Thank you so much for watching and tuning in. In this video, I'm gonna be installing this brand new blower motor on this amazing 1992 Mercedes 300 TE a wagon, amazing old school machine. And um, thank you so much for this company that sent me this blower motor. Actually, I can't wait to install it on this car and test it out and see how it works. I'm super stoked. You know, I'm pretty sure that the blower motor on this uh, old school machine has never been uh, changed. The car is basically over 30 years old and you know, I'm pretty sure the blower motor uh, is seized on this car, it's not working. So I'm um, super stoked to install this uh, amazing brand new blower motor from a premium uh, company. Thank you so much. And um, you know, I will let you know guys uh, what I think about this and uh, you know, we'll see how this blower motor works. I can't wait, you know, and uh, yeah, the main thing is this car has been put back on the road recently and the blower motor is not working and you really really need some kind of air blowing over your windshield especially when it's cold outside so all the links are going to be down below guys make sure to uh, check them out make sure to check out the e premium website and everything uh, they have a bunch of parts for these amazing old school machines and um yeah uh, super stoked to put this onto this car we're gonna go ahead and take this out right now just really want to see what's inside of this amazing box Take a look, guys. Wow, everything is nicely packaged too and awesome. Wow, look at this. This thing is brand new. Wow, it's heavy too. This thing is super heavy. How am I tripping? Or like, I mean, all of them are this heavy? I don't know. But this is literally brand new part. Man, I can't wait to install this on this amazing machine and the. Uh, you know, have the blower motor working again. This thing is awesome. Oh my goodness. And it's nicely packaged and it comes with that clip as well. Wow, I'm super stoked. Let's go ahead and start working on this amazing machine. I'm gonna start taking this seal off. Take this one out. So you can also see how bad these trim pieces are. I have some better used ones that I'll install. They have to come off though. So there are screws underneath of these trims. So you have to pull this trim so you just carefully like that straight out it comes out time to clean all this trash out too and as you can see this has to come out all these phillips screws Okay, I did this half moon shape. There's, there was uh, four Phillips screws, and then there was one screw, actually, I peel this carefully. There's one screw right there, I took it out. Now this thing is ready to come out, so I'm gonna pull this out now. So this clip that's attached here, you just pull on it, it comes out and then you can actually separate these pieces. Okay guys, so we got everything, all the plastics removed. Now we can go ahead and remove the wiper assembly. It's actually pretty easy. One, two, this guy right here, and then a few more on the other side, there's a connector too. So it's actually not too bad. Okay guys, so the wiper assembly is out. As you can see, we have access to the blower motor housing and everything. So I'm gonna start undoing these clips. One, two, three, four, all the way around, taking this cover off. There we 
there. Actually, right there, two more clips inside there. Disconnect the temperature sensor out of the way. There you go. This one is out. Here's our blower motor. And I could barely turn it. It's like difficult to turn this at all. Like crazy difficult. So I'm gonna go ahead and replace this bad boy right now and clean everything in the meantime. So this is pretty easy, this clip. You just pull on it and undo this way. Undo positive, negative. And then we can pull this guy out. The whole thing. Carefully. Like so. There it is. It's probably original, never been replaced. Barely any brushes left. And this turns really hard too. So now before we install our amazing brand new blower motor, I just want to clean this uh, right there from all the garbage. Make it clean. Toothbrush works the best. All right guys, after cleaning everything, prepping all the area and all that, we're gonna install the A Premium brand new blower motor on this uh, W or S124. And um, yeah, I'm gonna check the operation before I reinstall everything. I'm gonna check the operation of the blower motor, make sure it's all good and working properly. All right, this is all installed. I'm about to hook up the jumper to the battery and then turn this thing on, see how she does. So before you activate this beast, make sure you spin it by hand. It's not hitting anything that's all secure. Okay, there it is, it's working. I think the jumper is dying. It's at like nine volts. It's working, spinning. And then, let's try. Slower, I guess, setting. That's a slower setting. Awesome. Amazing. Blower motor is working. Now I just gotta put everything back together, guys. That's awesome. And by the way, don't be a worried if it's a little bit wobbling, it's fine. It's gonna be okay as soon as you, uh, you know, uh, mount the other uh, side. It's gonna be fine. There's nothing. Uh, some some of them actually, they, they do wobble a little bit, but as long as it's, like I said, you have to test it before you reinstall everything. You wanna make sure that it's not hitting the wall or anything. Okay, I'm starting to put the cover back on. As soon as you install these clips, you just need to make sure that everything is still good. That clip right there goes there. Goes there, and then make sure that you can still spin the blower motor easily without any issues. And she's doing good. Awesome. Hey yeah, guys, a little bit of fluid film right here. And then installing this part. And um, you know, I didn't go crazy with cleaning these parts and just kind of used the uh, the brush and you know, kind of cleaned everything as much as I could. I just don't have much time right now, but honestly, there's a video that you guys can watch. I did it on a 300E, I cleaned everything, power washed everything, but yeah. So this one, we're just gonna reinstall it right now that and then this part don't forget this clip it goes right in there like that it holds them both together this is how bad these ones are or where i'm gonna replace them with the ones that are in better condition so i have these ones i want to install they're in a lot better shape so that's what I'm gonna do. Okay, on this side of this screw has been missing and can't find one right now. So 
probably just install it as is. And we can install this good used trim piece. So we're gonna test the wiper. Just gonna add some fluid. Yay! Blower is working! Ooh! All right, uh, wiper. The battery's still kind of low, just so you guys know. Come on. There we go. Okay, cool. That's all good. Finally, the car is kind of looking complete. Amazing. Well, guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. Thanks so much for watching. And don't forget to like this video, subscribe, and uh, share this video with your friends. And don't forget to check out the products of the A Premium up here and also in the description box. And I'm super excited. Got the blower motor working and everything. And uh, it's just so amazing, you know, I love seeing fresh, I love seeing and installing fresh parts in these amazing old school machines because these are the only cars worth putting love and time into.